o sabió. This Kevin Gates stuff that's going on, well, we gonna get right to it. Cause Kevin Gates, um, yeah, let's just get to it, man. <laughs> For those that don't know what is going on right now, Kevin Gates pulled this girl up on the stage, one of his fans. He let her know that he was going to spit in her mouth. And she was down with it. This girl don't know Kevin Gates from a can of paint. I'm not saying that Kevin Gates got something, but you don't know what is going what is coursing through this man's blood you don't know what's going through this man's body so that just make me I, i'm trying to figure out like you know we live in a crazy world man this is how i know we are in the end of days because just uh, let, let, let's be play it man let, let, let's be play it that I, I i always tell y'all what do i always tell y'all i can never tell another man how to program i always tell y'all that but when it comes to this man whatever you do in your bedroom is what you do in your bedroom this i can't even call it a young lady y'all know i'm always rooting for women I'm always rooting for the woman, but I can't even call her a young lady. What I really want to call her is, is against what I talk about. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I, like, do, do you got kids? Do, do she have kids? Do you have anybody that love you? Anybody. Anybody. I mean, just look at this. This is just, yo, this is, what, and she like, yeah, never met this man a day in her life, never met this man a day, she never met this man a day of her life, I bet if her boyfriend, if her boyfriend said, let me spit in your mouth. She wouldn't do it. So it's like you will let a random man that you never met in your life degrade you in the worst way that a man could ever de de What uh, Ha Ha David say, this is beyond me. This is beyond me. This is crazy. This is beyond Dante, y'all. I, I can't comprehend it. I can't comprehend what I'm watching. I just can't. It, it, it's like... Do people have any self-respect nowadays? Any self-respect? It's like, I didn't even want to do this story, y'all. I really didn't. 
but I got over 1,000 emails, over 1,000 emails of, of people sending me this. And I'm like, man, I don't want to talk about this. I got to get ready to cook up another prison story for y'all. I got to get ready to drop that, them fire videos for y'all. I don't want to talk about this mess. I don't want to, this is, and y'all know how I be rooting for women. Y'all know how I be going in on dudes when they disrespect women. But this woman right here, this, this woman right here, it's like Dante can't do his job. How can I do my job when, when, when this type of stuff is going on? chew on this video right quick. I'm, I'm going to let y'all chew on this video right quick. I really want y'all to understand the type of trauma this girl had to, that she had to grow up with. You know what I'm saying? I don't know this girl lifestyle. I don't know this girl, how she grew up, but you have to really think very, very low of yourself to do this, man. It, you, you have to. No morals, no standards. I'm not saying that this man have any STD because I don't know this man at all. But for you to... Uh, Check this out, y'all. I'm going to start a podcast. I'm going to start a podcast. And with this podcast that I'm going to start, I'm going to allow y'all to get on the stage with me. And we're going to do, we're we, we going to kick it. We're going to kick it. I'm a, Matter of fact, if anybody got StreamYard, I'm going to put an invite out. If anybody got StreamYard, I'm gonna put uh invite guests in the description for y'all. So y'all make sure y'all click on this link that I'm posted right now. Y'all see that link that I just posted? If you wanna get on stage and comment with and, you know and kick it with Dante, click on that link that I just posted. Y'all see that? Click on the link. I'm going a, I'm to a do a lot more of these videos. I'm going to give y'all the prison stories. I'm a, matter of fact, let me show y'all something right quick. I'm going to show y'all something. But I, I really, it's, man, it's like, this world is so wicked, man. It's crazy. But mm, let me show y'all something. Real quick. Okay. So, this right here, y'all, is, is the, it's my lineup, okay? We got horrible crimes. Y'all know what that is. That's when I tell my horrible crimes, but I have my AI tell the stories okay then i got my prison stories over here that y'all like and for you people that like um to listen to my stories in the compilation 
you know, you got that playlist. You got my hood stories right here. And you got where I'm doing skits at right here. And the spot podcast, that's just me talking, you know, about things in the world. But um, oh yeah, right here, y'all, the stove. The stove is right here, y'all. Um, if you click on the link, it can take you to the main store where everything at, y'all. I got everything for men, women, kids, babies, accessories, all that. So y'all make sure y'all check that out too. All right. But I I really I really want to know how y'all feel about this Kevin Gates thing. I, I really, really do. Um, let me know, man. And the scary stories. Hold on, I gotta actually pin my other channel up here for y'all. But um, mm, 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 mm. Okay. <sighs> and also, y'all. Um, let me show y'all something right quick. In the description after this video in. If y'all want to get some merch from this guy named Smack Guy Merch, um, it's in the description below. Make sure y'all click on that link and check out this merch. I charge $20 a video for promotion, y'all. Okay, $20. So email me if y'all want me to promote your business or your social media channel. Y'all know how to get at me at the Dante Show 88 at yahoo.com for all business inquiries. But um at, as far as it go right now, it's it's I don't know man. This this ugh. There's something else I want to tell y'all. I done got the last video that I uploaded, the last video that I uploaded was the one where I said, I told the story about this cat that sold, that was got, that got his butt sold by his cellmate for a couple noodles. The jar, check that video out. It's, it's right here. Y'all see it right there? Sold for noodles. I got, like 300 comments on that video. One thing that somebody, well, a couple of people was asking me, it was like, man, uh, are you making this story up? Is, is this story real? It, they, I was asked, and that's a legitimate question. That is a real legitimate question. So if you want to know if I'm making this story up, hey, bae, bae, what? Come here right quick. I need for you to answer a question for me. Okay. All right. So for the people that, that want to know that I make up this story, just say right there. Okay. Is I making up this story? Okay. So apparently people want to know that is this story made up about this guy killing his grandmother because she told him no. Now... You leave the names out, but tell the tell your version of what happened. No, it's a true story. He was just real spoiled, and just one day, they told him he couldn't do something or something of that nature, and he just flipped out, killed his granny. And it was more to the story because he killed his granny, his granddad, and his uncle. Yeah. See, but, it's, it's a lot of stuff, y'all, that I leave out of these stories to protect the identity of you know other family members and what's going on so for the people that be wondering like if these stories real for the sake of people privacy and people got kids and family members and stuff you know i changed i changed names around i changed locations around but every story that i'm giving y'all is a hundred percent fact that one is very much true now um before you go, I want you to give me some, give me some commentary about this right quick. This is a blind reaction right quick. 
Uh, here, watch this. He about to give me a blind reaction of this right quick. All right, here we go. So I want you to watch this Kevin Gate video if you haven't watched it already. Okay. And give me your I haven't seen it. All right, here we go. <laughs> First off, you you know me. I don't care how freaky somebody can be. Mm -hmm. I don't do spit. So ain't nobody about to be spitting. I don't even know that man. I don't know that man. This 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 ain't my husband. I know your medical background, all that stuff. She don't know him from Adam. She don't know what he got. Right. No. Nah, that's enough. For don't me. know what this man no. got. And at all. you you could be the freakiest person in the world, but I'm sorry. I care about my health. I care about contracting stuff. I care about no, that's enough for me. That's nasty. That's <laughs> nasty. I'm not about to let a random person spit in my mouth. I'm not about to let a person spit on me, period. Uh, you know what I'm saying? Uh, what me and my husband doing our bedroom ain't nobody's business. How that's what I'm saying, man. Th this, people, is, this ain't that. You get what I'm saying? People need to, this, this, these, I, like I said, I can't never tell a man how to program. But what you do in your bedroom is. That's what I'm saying. Bedroom. This is separate. Like, you know, if we want to spit and get nasty, that's our business. But this ain't the case. This is a random man who she clearly idolized because she's just letting him just degrade her like that because because what if he got something right that she can contract from his saliva and she's trying that's 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 not cute that's not sexy that's nasty to me that's nasty and that's no shot to him but i ain't seen his my chart i ain't seen his medical records i don't know what this man got and then it looked like it was a loogie like all super thick and nasty. Uh, hell no i'm walking around that's nasty <laughs> well let me ask you this so uh, what do you got because i'm always taking up for women and stuff man what do you got to say about the Girl. I feel like, I mean, she seemed like she out, she out having a good time or whatever, but you got to have some more self-respect about yourself. You can't just be letting nobody spit in your mouth. They ain't married. Oh. They ain't, I mean, are they intimate? Do anybody know about them being together this sexually at all? This random fan. That's what I'm saying. No, random women fan. should have more self-respect about themselves. I understand you only live once and you're having a good time. However, you should care about what happens after that day. Like, you find out now you got strep throat or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, whatever. You don't know. You do not know what people got. He what? could his, his health could be perfectly fine, but I don't know that. I don't know that. Yeah, I mean. He could have just got done giving oral sex to his baby mama. Now you just spit in my mouth. Like, you, <laughs> like no, that's nasty. And then I wonder if she got a boyfriend. And even that. A husband, so like, boyfriend, somebody that, a, a situation ship, you know, that they together. I wouldn't be with her after that. If I publicly seen you ain't my husband right now, but you a dude that I mess with and you let so and so spit in your mouth. And no, don't even let me do it. You can want to say like no, nah, that's a negative. That's nasty. Nope. Nope. Not doing it. Not going for it. No. So like mm -hmm. her potential suitors, you know, he she might find somebody that she might fall, fall in love with and then this video pop up. I mean, just think about the mouth bacteria, period. And I'm not talking about on some sexual with my husband in the bedroom. I'm talking about right hand in there. You don't know if that man teeth brushed his teeth. You don't know nothing. And you just let him just, just degrade you like that. I see that as a sign of being degraded. Like other women might say, girl, you just extra. And no, nah, hell no. Nah. I don't care how much fun, how drunk, how high, whatever. No, nah, hell no. Nah. You're not about to spit in like, my mouth. Like, what's the point of that's that? The, it's, it's, people it's, think that's sexy. It, it kind of, just kind of seems no. like kind of demonic in a way, don't it? Like, that's like, just, it's, it's past, it's, it's demonic in its lack of self-respect. Like, ugh. you letting this random guy who, you don't know who he's sucking and effing and whatever the case may be, spit in your mouth. Like, spit. Ugh. It's so much, you know what I'm saying? 
y'all we know each other's medical background you spit on me and but that's our business but i'm just saying you don't know this man from adam you don't know this man from adam so what do you think is, do you think that you know because some people call her a hoe and like she just do you think it's uh, and then everybody in the crowd is loving this it. what like i'm saying that. you know what let's not even call her a hoe let's just talk about the self-esteem period because if you know your self-worth and you care about your health and you know mm. it's have self-respect you ain't about to let no, I don't give a care if you the biggest artist, period, spit in your mouth. I love me some, you know, some stars, but I'm not about to have him spit in my mouth. I go and to what, your concert what stars and you love? I love Bruno Mars music. Oh, okay. I think Bruno he, Mars. I love his music. I love, he got a soulful voice. I love Bruno Mars music. You know, I care about some of um, Chris Brown music. You think I'm about to let Chris Brown spit in my mouth? He damn near get slapped if he spit anywhere near me. Because that's 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 degrading. Did you just spit on me? <laughs> like, yeah. That's a negative. What, 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 can I ask you a question yeah. in, in front of the audience? Uh -huh. what, what, can you continue to be on my podcast? You know, because my podcast get boring after a while. I will only be to... on it if they if they ask for me. If they saying leave her out or, you know, it was good having her on the show. However, then yeah cause in, in, in the comment section i need for y'all to type one in the comment section if y'all want my wife to co-host my podcast with me or type two in the comment section if you don't want her to uh co-host with me yeah so i mean y'all like i said man this this video <sighs> I don't know, man. It's it's wild. It's, it's I don't know. It's wild. But listen, y'all. I gotta go work on some some more content. And um, ugh, ugh. Shout out to the world's best comments, which is y'all in the comment section, and um, which is Kevin. Y'all just let me know how y'all feel about this Kevin Gates business in the comment section. With that, y'all, I'm out.